Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Razor. Welcome back to Tales of Fantasia. In the last episode, we went to the Aegis Workshop and saw something that we could buy there for 400000 but we couldn't afford it. We then went and got a new art book uh, from a camp, from a pr person camping southeast of uh, Vanista. And then we went to Dimitol's manor or mansion, whatever, uh, in the future timeline. And we got the Tempest spell from that area. Um, the next area we're going to go to is the Abyss of Thor. We went there before in the other timeline. And now we're going to go back there again. It hasn't been that long either. I gotta find it though. Yeah, and we can get a new uh we can get a new summon for Clarf. What is this place? Check this place out. Oh, this is the w workshop. Is yes, yeah, the workshop. I wish I had a charm bottle. I could buy that. Uh. One item for two hundred thousand, but I don't have any. I don't have any charm bottles. Unfortunately, I'm trying to get more of them, but I don't know where to get them at. Oops, I didn't mean to speed it up. Next time, pause it too. Still trying to find this area. I might have to just cut the video here until I find it. If I don't find it soon. Yeah, I'm just going to cut the video here until I find it. And I'll be right back. Okay, here it is. Oops, so it help if I landed in the right spot. Yeah, is there any random encounters out here? I don't think there was last time, was there? Find out. Nope. Okay, I'll send her the Thor. Then. In this timeline. So it's not underwater. Well, obviously, because we raised it above the water in the other timeline. Whoa. It's a huge city right underneath us. Yeah, it's the lost city of Atlantis. No, I'm kidding. Wow. What a building. Hey, no, it's, it's actually New York, guys. Now you're in New York. <laughs> For the Thor's former glory, maybe. Okay, so we can get a new recipe here. Oh, it's downloading. Wow, that's cool. Fits, fits the area. Recipe fruit punch. Or fruit cocktail, whatever. A utopia of fruit adrift in an ocean of syrup. Restores a large amount of TP, but it requires a large amount of ingredients, too. Look at all that. 
It requires apple, strawberry, pineapple, grapes, prune, mango, steen, melons, bananas, and lemons. Holy crap. A talking robot. A progression per projection system. Called electricity for countless applications in their day to day lives. That's something I always found strange. Like, in like, I don't know so much in Final Fantasy, but in, in Suikoden, you had like a race called the Sindar, right? And they had advanced technology. And I guess the same ties to Star Wars as well. Um, like obviously the Clone Wars, you know, very futuristic stuff, right? And then, you know, 4, 5, and 6 came after the Clone Wars and all that. And they lost a lot of technology. And with the Sindar, they had advanced technology and they were an old race. And now this game, uh, the ancients had advanced technology. I don't understand how you could lose technology going forward. Like, how would your technology go down over time? I don't get it. But this is something I've seen in a lot of, uh, a lot of games and a lot of media. Like, obviously I mentioned Star Wars and Sweek It In. Uh, anyway, let's continue here. Game channel. Start the game. What the hell is this? This is a mini game. Oh my god it is. So we gotta dodge shit. Yep. Oh my god, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. This is like a one of those old school games where you shoot them up or whatever what are they called? I don't even know. Oh, you can shoot down too. Okay, I didn't know that. Those are super powerful. This like. Crap. I'm dead. Ugh, man. Time. I'll try it again here, I guess.
Ugh. It's hard. <sighs> Scored sixty six thousand. Negate normal black ball shots. So, do you go to the next stage? Damn. Right, I'm not doing that again. That's starting to get stupid. Public access channel. This fighting in the Ragnarok War continues. Odin's search for brave warriors broadens. Warriors capable of withstanding tests of Odin, Chief God, have been promised magnificent weapons and reward for their efforts. Science Channel. Spirit of Light Asuka was recently captured. The head of biological studies expects to be a detailed study on it within a few days. And the News Channel. They are leading story story is on politics at approximately 2 p.m. today the kingdom of Fenrir and the Odin Republic engaged in fierce combat along their military borders King Ralph I of Fenrir and Odin's president Janos the declaration of peace broke down in three days in response Gargas president of Thor issued his statement I continue to hope that this or this statement I meant to say I continue to hope that this conflict may be resolved through dialogue however if the situation does not calm we will intervene and end it by means of aerial bombing it seems there will be further debate concerning President Gargas military proposal now for our next story Thor's National Science Institute has announced that Samuel's Comet whose course is expected to graze the planet as almost no chance of 
striking the planet itself. We have video from the press conference. At first, some said that the city of Thor will fall, but that was complete demagoguery. According to our supercomputer's calculations, the comet's tail will miss our planet by just enough distance so as to not disturb any it in any way. Complete. Okay, that's it. That's kind of cool. Except for that mini game. Let's play a music video. Okay. As long as it ain't copyrighted. It's gonna be copyrighted, isn't it? Tamura. This is still gonna get copyrighted. And it's gonna be muted. The stuff put the stuff Japanese put in their games. It's kind of funny. You never see anything like this in like western RPGs. Which is why I love Japanese RPGs. The uniqueness. They're completely different though. Japanese role playing games to regular RPGs. It's like. Night and, the difference is insane. Like there's no similarities between a JRPG. And a Western RPG. They're completely different. How long does this go on? Okay, it's almost over. There we go. Thank you. We're finally being over. Alright, I wasn't expecting that to take so long. Alright, that's everybody. Go ahead and leave that place. And we'll enter the other building down over here. But we are going to save it first. In case I get a game over. Which I hope I don't. But you never know. Yep, looks the same. Looks the same. Are these the Jin? What are these things called again? Jan, okay. It might be the same one. But, I don't know, I guess I'll do that anyway. Yeah, it's the same one as the other timeline. They're not really worth fighting. Because they don't give barely any XP. There's random encounters around here, of course. Okay, got the common key. Okay. Uh, one of the enemies around here can drop the laser weapon. I think. I don't know about in this version of the game, though. Okay, 4400R. And also we have 10,000R.
Not a lot of EXP or gold. Okay, you don't have to use all the ingredients. Okay, you just have to use some of them. Okay, we know no to me. Uh, actually, no, I think we fought more men in the other timeline. But maybe they're, maybe they're upgraded or something. I don't know. I'm just gonna make a safe state here until I find the right door, the correct door leading to where we can advance. I don't want to go. Oh, nope, that leads back, so that's not the right one. Okay, must be one of these last two. Yep, there it is. Oh! Or, oh, I didn't get this before. God's Breath. Okay. I could have learned that before. Grandmaster Wind. Squash the enemy with extreme atmospheric pressure. Ooh. Alright, we gotta get another key now, though. Let's try it out. God's breath. 3,000 damage, that's pretty good. Yeah, not bad. I like it. Now we need to get another key. There we go. Now we need to find the correct door. Oh, we have a new enemy, Living Sword. Or maybe, no, I think we fought one of them before. Die. The hell back. I don't take him myself, then I guess. 
I barely survived that. We got cornered. And they ate through my character's defense like it was toilet paper. Or cut through my character's defense like it was toilet paper. Oh, she has resurrection now. I didn't even know. That's why I saved it outside, because I knew something bad was going to happen, playing on hard. Okay, let me find the right door now. Just going to speed this up here. Nope. There we go. Means this is activated bio room check. Okay, now we want to choose data concerning Spirit Asuka. Asuka, whatever. Mission confirmation code WSC one six five two seven. Do we have to fight it, or do we just get it? And I gotta do it. I gotta, I gotta sing it here and now. I offer my request to the spirit of light. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. Garf can now summon Aska. Okay. That's everything. Alright, so we'll check that out. Some of the Spirit of Light. Okay. 
All right, I'm in the video here. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode where we will head to the next area in the future. God bless you all. Later.